So, would you like to introduce yourself? Hi, my name is Lionel Haas, and um, I've been living in Berlin for quite a while, almost 14 years. And um, I'm a piano player, and I've been fortunate enough uh, to get a uh, to get a foothold, you know, in the musical community, in the jazz community around here. And um, I am involved in a lot of projects around here, here in Berlin. Among others, uh, two jam sessions that I that I host. One of them is the New Standard Jam Session at the Edelweiss in Berlin Kreuzberg, and the other one is the Jazzy Berlin Jam Session um, that takes place every Wednesday evening at Katerholzig. And um, I also have uh, the honor and privilege of being part of the Rumtreiber Jam Session, which is a collaborative uh, project uniting several uh, jam sessions around Berlin. And uh, I'm quite privileged to be a part of that. And how do you think the jazz scene is thriving in Berlin at the moment? Well, it is, I can only say it's, it is amazing. It's been amazing lately in the last couple of years. Um, not only have a lot of clubs, venues uh, emerged around Berlin. Uh, I mean, I do. I remember a time, uh, almost like like a little less than ten years ago, when when the jazz scene or the music scene was sort of in a decline. Um, turns out that this decline has been temporary, and now. It's been growing again. A lot of clubs, a lot of venues have emerged. I mean, Berlin, compared to other cities uh, around Europe, I would say, is uh, relatively active and you know offers a lot of opportunities, you know, for all these countless artists to you know uh, to pr present themselves and to perform. And in the last couple of years, not only have, have there been more chances, uh, more exposure has there been more exposure to musicians, but uh, we're experiencing a great influx of great talented musicians, especially young ones. I mean, I've been amazed lately how many uh, young people have emerged, in the, like like people in the early 20s, and such talents, you know. And that uh, that of, that of course gives me hope uh, that you know the music is going to continue thriving, especially jazz. So I think it's a really good development. Right. And what do you think is special about the Rum Tribers and Area 61? Well, what is special about uh, the Rum Triber Jam Session is really the fact that it is well, it is a it is a jam session that is kind of harnessing um, all the other jam sessions. Not only the other jam sessions, but uh, but the great you know the uh, the diversity of musicians. I mean, we're not only talking about jazz music. I mean, jazz music, as you know, is 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 unique in that it uh, unites a lot of uh, a lot of musical styles. You know, it influences from around the world, uh, including uh, Latin jazz, Afrobeat, and, and and rap and hip hop. And that's what makes uh, the Room Triber um, jam session so special, and uh, and uh, the location of it, uh, Area 61. I mean, I would consider it uh, home, you know, and and it represents for me it embodies a community and family of music. And what does the future hold for Lionel Hearts? Um, well, uh, I would just uh, like to continue. You know, I, I just want to, like, like with any uh, any musicians, I want to be as good as I can be, and uh, be able to, you know, continue to contribute you know, to to the musical energy that's now taking place and that's uh, thriving. And uh, I just want to play a lot, play more in and outside of Berlin and be the best that I can be.